Hey guys, I'm doing a 2 vs 2 siege with a perfect Germania army, at least I think it is. Only in my other video, but my commentary for some reason didn't work. Um, <clears throat> so now I changed the classic OBS and not the new OBS here. Um, and I'm just trying to get a game going here, but this guy doesn't want to spend his money. I'm going to tell him to spend your money. I don't know what he's saying. Anyway, I got six chosen X-Men, as you can see, six Zergs, Gold Attack, two Gothic Cavalry, and uh, uh, three Archers, Gold Attack, and uh, Switching Women, and one. I would like one more Warhound, but uh, I'll just have to use this one in a, at a very, very good timing, very good moment. And uh, I'm going to really be careful with my calf here. I'm not sure if this is worth it with this many. I mean, I'm always thinking about the perfect army. I should think about what the hell I'm facing with really. it. But against this, I'm happy. And against this, I'm happy too. The arch is going to be value, very valuable. Hmm. Yeah. I would just like to have some something to talk with Pila though, if I could. But. Uh, It is what it is. Maybe like remove one of these maybe. Ah, whatever. If he, he only wants to spend 18, then whatever whatever, I'm not I'm not gonna bother with that more. Oh I hope it I hope that Egypt had spent more than, than ten thousand or whatever it was, ten thousand six hundred and thirty six or whatever it was. Was that the troops one thousand thirty six? I'm not sure. But my plan is I'm gonna go outside with my arches and my calf, like my calf and my arches. Originally I had 20 units. It was 3 arches, no upgrades, and 2 doggies. But I figured it was worth it to remove 1 dog and get 600 extra denarii in order to get the gold upgrades. So that's minus 1 dog, but you get like 9 upgrades. And attack of fate. That's a lot. Fear eats their hearts. Fear of me. Fear of you. Now. I think one upgrade is 70 denarii, if I remember correctly. Uh, for not you. So let's see what he has. Yeah, I'm happy he has some of these actually. Mostly just for soaking Pila. Uh, I like noble cavalry. I like them so much. What a uh, what I should, well, what I'm trying to say, whether I want to like them, I really want to like them, and when I play gold, I try and pick them. But the fact of the matter is that they're it's like I classify them as medium cavalry, and it's just not a good unit. Or I guess you can say it's a good unit, but it's definitely not a great unit. And for the price and what you like, for the price and like the cost of it, and when you pick the unit, you want a great unit. You don't just want a good unit. Uh, I hope my headset is enough. People laugh at doggies, but uh, they're gonna get surprised. But my whole strategy involves two things. Three things. First of all is timing with everything, like everything when I attack and where I come from. I guess that includes positioning, but mostly like timing. So one, timing. Two, fatigue. I need the enemy to be tired. And lastly is, um, I need that general that. Damn, seems like I'm losing a lot of connection, like I don't have enough power in my headset or something. It's almost dead. Well I hope I can survive this battle. And I have a have to recharge it. Uh 
Um, let's get these behind, and then let's get these behind again. There we go, I like this. I like that. Let's get that going. And restricted again, I forgot to turn it off again. Troops over here. I thought I crashed that or something. Oh, that's a way to deploy. You gonna laugh at my women too? Right, I'm just gonna go here. I'm gonna go for Egypt. I want to kill those pikes. If I kill his general, he's absolutely fucked. Well, they both are. Yeah, that nice. Let's put it all the way out there. So, uh, let's check out my allies' army here. What did you have? There's a bunch of noble cavalry and pikes, really, and a few. Uh, Few arches. Yeah, just go. I'm so surprised at the amount of idiots on these. Uh, in multiplayer, it's crazy. I wonder how these guys get through their day. J you can deploy when the game started. I just want to get going. Is he any upgrades? Is he max his upgrades on like one unit? He's almost done here though. There we go. Seems to have a lot of arches. Can my ally see too when I have my units here? I hope he can, that, that, that would be sweet. Makes you not sure. I used to always play on restricted mode in single player. And I didn't mind that, but whenever I had been forcing armies, I so badly wanted to see how they were doing and I couldn't. And I didn't mind that again because, well, I can see how that might be cheating or too easy then. But I just wish I could have seen the replay then. But it might be like, oh, well, then you can learn the tactics. But like, yeah, why right, learn the tactics with the AI? But okay then, sure. But then at least let me see when the whole campaign is over. But no, that ain't gonna happen. This is de Desert Cavalry. They actually, they have armor piercing, so they're actually quite good. Nile Cavalry is not good. Neither is, um... Sacred Bank cap. cap. I should put these in loose right away. Yeah, this is a pretty strong combo. Because I can have my arches in a, in a really good position. And if you go to my arches, you might lose a few arches. But then I can get a huge charge for, by my, for my cavalry. I'm lagging a bit here. Right. Hope I can wild him. Right. 
Nice, very nice. The enemy army is running like a startled goat. Enemy warlord lies dead. Now he can drink with his Perfect. ancestors and watch his warriors. Flee. I couldn't, I couldn't ask for a better start than that. I lost like 12 guys. Oh, okay, and some of those, that's 22 guys. Yeah, that's nothing. Is a and you will need to disable cutscenes. Drive them out. Because of this, and I can't control my units. The enemy have taken the walls. Throw them back, or our people will be slaughtered. Come on. Very nice. It seems like I have a very hard time controlling my units. I'm lagging a lot, I feel. Definitely, it's definitely making it a bit difficult here. Come on, what are you guys doing? Shoot! Yeah. How about you shoot at the ones I told you to? There we go. That was close again. I just want to keep them out here for as long as possible, really. Oh, it's actually a mistake that I actually all for them. But damn, that's my first mistake in this battle. I was doing so well. But I actually didn't mind. I was just not all all that many. I, I, I just didn't want to activate all, like, all of those at once. But oh well, I'm committed now. Still a mistake, no matter how good it was. But a lot of circles at once is good, it's gonna make him route very fast. I know he has pikes, but it might not be that big of a deal. If, uh, if I can just get him. To mass route here.
way too zoomed out here. There we go. I'm not even gonna walk by here or anything. Well, I'm gonna do it now. There we go, let's the hit him with that. Hunt them down and slay them all. Okay, let's go inside here again with my guys. Holy shit, he's lost a ton of archers. I don't think they're gonna come back, are they? So far, so good. Actually, I'm gonna keep these guys outside. This guy's only chance is using his archers, really. I kind of want to keep these guys alive, so it, uh, for as long as possible before they go for him. Let me just go over there. Usually I, I like to mix them in with uh, X-Men, so it's just like, let's say for every third X-Men, there's uh, a Zerka, so it's just like a really it's a super powered, uh, like a super chosen X-Men. But having a huge blob like this is absolutely devastating. And it's like, you don't just have 24, you have like, let's say 80 of them. I guess you can say 72 is a full unit or I'm or um, like 96 but like 3 4 of those together is, is just insane even just 2 of them um, but yeah like 2 3 is probably optimal 3 and uh, like it's absolutely crazy how much uh, damage they can do and how fast they can tear through them and that is really, really the effect of the berserkers then they can really tear through them fast and make them wow rather than just being like an extra good unit. Yeah, you know what? I'll I'll activate these guys too. aggressive here. Wow, I'll just keep losing connection with my fucking headset. Fucking Astro bullshit. Should have stuck with my Siberia and bought the 800 one I wanted, but no, I was just on research and still I got a shitty one. See, these are my real doggies. Let's move 
these a bit forward. And there we go, start screaming. See, it sounds like when you read the description of these, that they lower the enemies from well and raises yours, but f now I really thought about it, and I think compared to like druids who only boost your morale, these get the, these girls they don't boost your own morale, they just lower the enemies' morale. So these these girls are more like the aggressive ones, while the druids are more of the more of the, def the, the defensive ones, so to speak. You just need to threaten him, so while my guys are coming out, my cavalry here is threatening them. Looks like he's not really paying attention. Now he is. Yeah, I'll lose my calf, but that's okay. I'm okay with losing my calf now. Look at them go, look at them fall. There we go. Big fight here. equal but here my circs come and they're gonna be the finishing blow there we go you have killed the enemy general now that's it show fear now they may turn and run attack attack Enemy have been utterly broken. This is a most worthy victory. Heroic, nice. Wow. Yeah, my cat did a job. Access did fine. No real losses there. What? Ah, well, it's okay. I kill you too. Just enough. Sucks did fine. Well, sort of. Yeah, nice. Good battle. Alright, so 2v2, gem, D, HV. Let's call it 2 then. Alright, good game. See you next time. Bye for now.